Hello everyone, welcome back. Dope and Rope here. Some more projects on Boyd. I hope you're all good. I am quite good myself. Um, right, before I do all this shit, I'll just show you. It's been a couple of days. I don't know if you keep track of the days. But I've done my usual, where I've spent time cutting trees down and basically laying, laying the wood. Why is that light out? Um, because it's, everything's starting to get really fucking messy. So I thought I had to. I had to lay this shit down, otherwise it's just, ugh. So yeah, that's what I've been doing for, I think it's like two, three days, I don't know. But I cooked up a load of meals, and been cutting down trees and laying, in, laying down the wooden floors. So that's what I've been doing. Not much, but it needs to be done. It's all the shit that you don't really need to see. And, uh... I wonder what that fucking was, then. And I've been obviously, well, <laughs> once again, I've ate most of the bloody food that I've cooked up in the time it's took me to make all of this shit. But I have made a load of food, which is good because it's put my weight is going back up up to 74 now, so that's good. So as long as I keep on top of it, it should stay increasing, ideally. I've never had him overweight, so I wouldn't mind getting him overweight, just to see. I'm sure it's probably a bad thing. So today, let me just finish this. I'll bring the map up. Do, 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 do. Oh, and I did quickly go back up here because I was because I've been going up here so much and it's just been going wrong. So I've I did it off screen. Literally <clears throat> nothing. No one fuck all in here. So I've checked these houses out, just got some more food. I think I got like three or four shotguns, but no like samurai swords or anything like that. And I did chuck a couple of molotovs at these ones, just to see how well they burn. They burn quite well, the houses. It seems to be everything else that's fucking a bitch to burn. So yeah, I've done that off screen. Like I say, there wasn't fuck all there. Nothing really adventurous happened. I'd always I'd have stopped and quickly recorded, even if it was a short video. So today, so fucking else. So today I am going to go over to here. Check these houses out. I'm pretty sure that's a school, but you know, I'll have a look around here. Shoot some zombies. I'm taking my crowbar, but it's gonna be in my backpack. I'm just taking shit's out of shotgun shit. I'd probably take a few more. Got my two shotguns, because I think he might break. And I got my pistol, seeing as he's getting a little bit better with his shooting skill. Plus he's got three magazines, so I can just quickly switch them over instead of having to load the individual bullets each time. So that's the plan. So I'm going to grab another box of shotgun shells. I'd rather have too many than too few, to be honest. And I might take a Molotov. Do I have one here? I'll quickly make a Molotov, just in case all the gunfire literally attracts. I already have made one. Ah, see, I... I'd prepared <clears throat> in case me shooting just attracts so many zombies that I need to actually burn them. Right, so yeah, it, it was there wasn't fuck all over there in the houses that you didn't see. I took some spears this way. They're in the car here. It's just a random car I grabbed. Most of it's still in the bloody in the car. There was luckily, luckily but nicely there was a. One of these houses, I can't remember which one exactly, but it's got like a, it might be that one, I think it is that one, it's got like a bar out the back, which is fucking ooh, fancy fancy, but add even more, even more bourbon, not that I'm short on it, but even more, and I've set up this, which I forgot I even had, this like old school, it's like a heater slash cooker, so... But I don't want to put it in my base in case it catches fire, so I'm a bit like, Ugh. so I'm just leaving it there and trying it out to see if it does actually catch fire or not. So far, it's been okay, but I don't know. It's still, it's very risky bringing that in there, and then it burning the whole fucking thing down. Come winter, I'll just put on so many warm clothes I shouldn't need it. But you never know. So I will take. I don't know what vehicle to take. I should probably take a decent one. In case I come across anything that I want to pick up. But then I could also come across a different car that I want to take. Ooh, it's a tough... 
decision on which right is take take this one. Ugh. There's still stuff in these fucking vehicles. Right, we'll take this one. He says. If it starts. Take the gas can because you never know what's over there. Uh, put the container. Bip, bip, bip. Right, let's go. So I'm pretty much just going to shoot everything. Oh, I see. That was, that was me being stupid. Very stupid. I was looking at stuff. Yeah, I'm just going to shoot everything when I'm over there. Just because I'm in a shooty kind of mood. That's from my last mistake, where I don't pay attention. So I think it's pretty much the first turning, isn't it? Yeah, it's the first turning off. <clears throat> now, I would have thought there'd be quite a few zombies over here because I haven't been able to clear it out. But it depends how many have been drew, uh, drawn off by all my previous gunfire and stuff. We shall see. So what I'll do is I'll wait till I get a shit ton of them following me, then I'll start blowing them away. But I'll also try and check out some houses as well. Ooh, that's normally a good sign. Well, either means they've bored zombies in there or it's someone's old base, in which case they might have a little good shit in there, so that's good. Quick look around. It's not too bad, but I guarantee as soon as I start, start shooting my gun, I'm gonna get fucking swarmed. Yeah, there will be a few. This, I think, will be a school. I get the feeling that's a school. <coughs> but we shall see. Kill all the zombies and I can have a good look around. Then. Yo, 
little bit of panic, not too bad. I didn't bring any food with me, that's one thing I should have done. But there'd be plenty of food in these houses. I bought the Molotov just in case I get so many bloody zombies I need to burn them. Try out the pistol. Should be a bit better with it now. Not too bad. Wasn't counting my bullets, should do. Sticky in there, switch back to the old shuttle gun. God, there's a fucking tunnel. Oh. oh Christ. Avoid the trees. Massacre. Open that. Let's switch up to the pump action. Give you a go for that. I moved. So he's got seven. Okie dokie. Six. Five. Oh, you do, do fucking racket. Shit. Alright, so he should. 
should be back up to seven again. I thought that was going to happen. Yeah, if you keep going backwards too much, shit will come up behind you. Fuck this. Where the fuck are they all coming from? Ooh, going that way. Try and get back to the road. I don't want to be caught around here. Oh, shit. I'm going to get caught around here. It with just a couple of zombies. You want a nice bunch. I don't want to shoot my van. Nice. Fuck, I'm out of shotgun shells. Jesus Christ, I am. I think it's Molotov, son. I'd piss through my ammo that quick, but clearly I did. Right, I need to stick that pump action shock. 
gun into my bag. Try and get them all to come this way. That should do it. Right, so equip that again. Noise, noise, noise. Yes, that's it. Keep coming. I think that's all my bullets. Yep. Okie dokie. Good old crowbar. Not that I plan to fucking hit anything. Let the fire do the work. Right, well, now we just play the waiting game. Careful, I didn't burn everything down before I got in it. Anyway, I wouldn't have thought there'd be much in the schools, but you do tend to find quite a lot of guns in them for some sick reason. Be able to sneak away and let them all burn up. <coughs> I might, probably won't, but I might. Just gotta get far enough away. Oh, Jesus. My fault for splitting them all. I should never run around the back of the fucking buildings. Could try and get them all out. Yes, that's it this way. some of these bloody buildings to fire. It's not a big deal. It's not like there's a shortage of buildings in this area. He's got a gun.
hope that guy with the shotgun didn't catch on fire. Towards the light. Thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, go on, quick, get her. Let's get in the van where he just needs to rest. There we go. If I say park over here, <clears throat> hopefully I should lose them. Maybe, maybe. Oh, I picked the wrong house, didn't I? I think I'm all right. Just be careful in case they do actually come up. Yeah, see, if he'd have kept coming, I'd have been fucked. Luckily, though, I think I've got far enough away. Officer and Bush. I might take that plant actually. I should do my usual run around to make sure everything that is behind the door is banging on the door, so I know where they are. Unread, that's good. Cool. Just double check nothing's coming. I am paranoid something's going <clears> to <throat> walk up behind me. I haven't got one, I'm stuck now, so every time I um, build the floors it's just pointless, because I'm not getting fuck all towards my carpentry skill. Beer, grab that. Okay, it was handy with the cooking. I took a few mouse traps, so I don't know what they're actually any use for. Um, there's actually any use for them. It's the one I did put down, he just hasn't caught any mice yet. Oh, cooking pot. Yeah. Always time for cooking pot. Okie dokie. Oh, 
Please come fucking up here. I'm still looking for the Metalwork Magazine 1, I think it is, which lets me build the metal walls. The metal floors as well, I believe. Which would be very handy. So hopefully I'll find it around here. something but I didn't bring a can opener with me. I'm sure I'll come across something. I could grow nowhere bars so I know there was one in that hiking bag back there but I can't be fucked to rummage through a hiking bag just for a granola bar. this window. Eat the ground crackers. Grab the beer can, fuck it. Like I say, they come and help, um, come in handy for cooking your stews and stuff. Oh, this is good. Good, good. I'll take the eggs. I can eat they now. I'm going to eat the cereal. I'm going to eat all the cereal. Mmm, dry cereal. What have we got here? I'll take that. Always time for videos. that so I'll take him. Grab the book. Maybe not, fuck it. Magnum. No bullets in it unfortunately. I've once come across a battery charger, but I never got to the stage where I could put it down and actually use it, so I'd love to find another one. Just because it's something I've never actually used. Hopefully most of those zombies have died now from the fire. Sounds like there's like 50 fucking zombies behind that door. But it looks like it's only one.
crazy. Listening for things, in case I, because it's so fucking dark. Nah, fuck this. It's too bad. Can't see. It's not how I want to go out. Handy. Can reload my pistol. Right. right, let's quickly reload my gun. Just in case I need it. Right, so check the magazine. To open the box bullets. Pointless having my shotgun at the moment. Put that in there as well. Okie dokie. Oh, I should probably have my crowbar out. That would have been bad. Oh, I need to. Uh, yeah, I need to do my running around trick. Otherwise I'm going to open a door straight into a fucking zombie. See, I'd have, I'd have been fucked then if I didn't do that. That's fine, I can deal with that. Good, good, good. Another gun. Okay, drop some of this stuff off. Yeah, now he's getting better with his shooting. I can start coming out with like the rifles and stuff like that. Shotguns are still probably be best, but it'd be nice to mix things up a little bit. Come on, you fucker. 
No, not on the bastard floor. It's because I never shut the back, but I've been recently shutting it because I did hear that stuff actually falls out the back. I've never seen it happen, but I don't know. I don't want to risk it. But I can't say I've ever seen it happen. But just because I haven't seen it happen don't mean it hasn't happened. Come on, mate. Just chuck it in the back of the fucking van. greatest, but I could always use it just to run over some zombies. But I would need to put fuel in it. Propane twice. I've got so many of them. Oof. Didn't think that through, did I? Fuck it. Not nice. Not nice. I mean, it's stupid shooting them, because all I'm going to do is draw more bloody zombies to me, but... It's still fun. Although, I haven't drew as many as I thought I would. So I might have killed the vast majority of them earlier, which should be good. What's this? Long socks will take them, because they'll always come in handy. I don't think there's anything in these buildings, or in these rooms. Says, but you should still be careful. Might take that denim shirt because it will at least be um, completely like new. He's not going to have any holes in him, basically. Is what I'm trying to say. That's fine. Another cooking pot. Can't complain. Take the 
tune off. Something's walking around. Oh, fucking hell. Getting distracted by like food. And I got plenty of bloody food. So I should just concentrate on getting bloody guns. Guns and ammo. Ooh, this could be a good one. Because this was the boarded up house, so hopefully it will have a shit ton of stuff inside it. Not just a shit ton of zombies. Now I'm hoping there's going to be a shit ton of guns and weapons in this one, like in the last one. But they might have just boarded it up because it was full of zombies. nails in them. So I'm hoping for guns and swords. Oh yeah. This shit. Sledgehammer, but he's pretty damaged. I did pick up two more a while ago when I uh, went out. <clears throat> so I've got three sledgehammers now. It's more than I'm ever going to really need. I really don't like using them as weapons. They are great weapons, don't get me wrong, but they do destroy your stamina. Attach that to your pack. take that because I'm not too sure if I have it or not. I'm pretty sure I got electric electronics number two, fish and four. I'm just going to try and take all the fours because I'm not too sure if I've got the fours with any of them. I might do but I might not. be back. I 
I should just go out really looking for the, where the houses that are boarded up because they seem to be the ones that have the good shit in them. Busy to keep a track of my food. It's still going up, that's good. I need to try and keep it going up. Once it stops, it's a bitch to get going up again. I think that's the trick, is once it is going up, as long as you keep it going up, you're alright. But when it stops going up, it takes a mission to get it to go back up. I'm speculating there, so don't hold me to that. Fed, so I'll eat the other one. Hopefully that will make me fall to bursting. Yeah, that's good. Fall to bursting is what you want to aim for, I think. Yeah, <laughs> see that shit. Ooh, plus two. He's going to be a fat bastard by the time I'm done. They do put animals into this game, and if they put wolves into this game, it would be horrific. Oh yeah, machete. This is good, because it means I can start using bladed weapons now. Now I've got a couple extra. So I think I'm going to start using the machetes, and then... Once I've got my long bladed up, I will move on to using the katana. Hopefully I'll find some more katanas, but they seem quite few and far between. I don't need the caliper, I've got plenty of they. Pardon me. Right. just took a swig of energy drink, so I'm a bit gassy, so I apologise. Right, open that and run. Open that and run. Awesome. It's only a bathroom, unfortunately. I was hoping it'd be like another bedroom. That's everything, is it? Shit. I was hoping for another uh, katana. Would have been nice. But hey. Should not complain. Definitely leaving better off than I did when I went in there. Uh, already red. Okay. Ah, you sick son of a bitch. took the sledgehammer just to bang these doors down, but uh, it's not the biggest deal when you've got windows. Don't want to do that one because I can't see inside. Yeah, crouching can get your ass killed, because it takes that little bit longer to turn around and run. And I 
say that because it has literally got me killed before. <clears throat> Same the crew I mean, it's a solid piece of like steel. So. White wine. Take that bucket. It's quite helpful for um, boiling water. Still no carpentry. <laughs> it all come in handy. This, the dried stuff's really good for when you're making your stews. And I mean, plus it just lasts forever, so. Well, as far as I can tell, it lasts forever. Right, not too bad. Not too bad at all. I cannot complain. Quite a good haul, really. Fucking shit ton of guns, shit ton of weapons. Up, 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 up. Speaking of shit ton of stuff, just grab the bulletproof vests. Which were in here. Plus his shooting skills gone up again, which is bloody good. I wanted to go in the back of the van. Gotta watch the bloody time as well. Still got plenty of time, but I don't want to be stuck out in the dark. Most of those are done quickly. Hop in here. Like cross out that one, that one. I think that one was the one I didn't check because it had some in it. But that one, that one, that one. I think that one and that one are done. I'll have a quick drive around, like around that, around the block, or whatever you want to call it just to see if I can see any more boarded up houses.
come on. Oh, come on, I moved. I fucked it, I fucked it, I fucked it. The amount of times I've tried to do that and then faffed about trying to get in the actual fucking driver's seat. It's just like, oh no. It's panic. That's what panic does to you. It makes you do stupid things. dollar sign but I couldn't see it quick enough. Fucking out of all these zombies. Definitely gonna need to bring a Molotov with me. most of these with the gunshots but they didn't get close enough because I stopped shooting although they might just be what spawned in because there probably will be a shit ton of zombies in certain areas where I haven't been yet getting all confused as to where I am shit out of it, I think. Makes sense you can, but I'd still be like, no. I gotta be careful, because I have flipped a car in here. It was off screen, because I was, uh, it was a while ago when I was coming back from grabbing some bloody what was I grabbing? I was grabbing like axe or something. I can't, what was I grabbing? I was grabbing something, but I was coming in, took the corner too too quickly, hit the fucking one of the corpses and it tipped it over. And I was like, oh, not again. So you've got to be really careful, even if it's just one bloody corpse, evidently. You can flip your fucking car if you hit the wrong angle. Right. So. Good, good, good. Got me a shit ton of stuff. do at some point need to go and fill up all my gas cans because I've got so many of them now. Because I've been just grabbing them all the time. So I need to go and fill them up really. Right. Bloody hell. I might just organise this off screen because it's going to take some time. 
good few guns, which is good. More magazines, which is good. It's good to have lots of magazines. It makes reloading a hell of a lot quicker. And machetes, which is really good. Magnum. So you got an M. Four times scope, recoil pad. That's good. Sawn off, so okie dokie. Yes, so I've got a good bit of stuff there. Ooh, no, I didn't, I didn't get my book, did I? Eat some food. Make sure my shit's still going up. Check my generator. Should be all good. Yep. Mouse trap. Still nothing, I presume. Because you can remove it. And then literally put it. Um, if you like, right click. You can place trap. So. I don't know where you're supposed to put it. Like, where you're supposed to do it. Is there a, spe a specific place you're supposed to put them? I presume maybe you put them over here more than over here, but I don't know. I might look into that because I picked up like three or four more of them, so I might uh, check out. Oh, can I not get that? I need a bloody thingy. Um, just stick some dot around in random locations and see what happens. Fine, don't need water. Fine, doesn't need water, so that's good. So this is good. Good, good, good. Still need to get some more wood. Still need to finish out, out the front as well, really. Because it's getting so overgrown. Although some of this stuff will be nice once I get my foraging up, because I think some of these are going to be like berries and shit that you can actually... Scavenge. Um, scavenge, but I haven't got because my foraging skill so shit. He doesn't even recognise them as something you could pick up. But I think I'll struggle to find things to pick up in here because it's by base. I'd need to go like, like if I went like out there or down this bit. Pick, you'd find a lot more stuff. You still do. I have found things. I found like crickets and stuff like that, but not as much as I think you do when you're in like a wooded area because I've cut down all the fucking trees. But yeah, I will. I will at some point get my foraging skill up because it is really good. You find some good stuff. And obviously, if you find. If you run out of like um, axes and stuff, you can find sharper stones, and you can make your own makeshift tools. They're not as good, obviously, but at least it means you can. You could literally go bare bones and have nothing, and you could still survive. So it's a different way of doing it. Because eventually, if I mean, if you live long enough, if you live for multiple years, eventually you would lose all this stuff would break eventually and you would have to start crafting your own stuff so it's a possibility if he ever lives that long anyway could you chuck that over there right well, that's pretty much it for the day I'm afraid guys I can't do a huge amount now I got no I need that carpentry book so I haven't got a book to read Tailoring I could read, but I'm not even doing tailoring. Trapping. I should probably read. Even though I've, I can't figure out how to use the fucking traps properly, but... It might pay to just read it, just get it fucking read. 
up other than that. Oh, that's 75, so that's fucking sweet. He's still classed as underweight though, which is annoying, but still. And next time I am going to head over to there and see what's in there. I might just do like a little episode where I go around just finding all these boarded up buildings. Maybe if I do like this chunk, I just drive around, find all the boarded up ones, do the boarded up ones, and that'd be, I mean, it's surprising how quick the day goes. So I got it set for two two hours in total, but it's an hour of daylight and an hour of night, so you get an hour of day. It's surprising how quick it fucking goes, mind. Right, but anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please feel free to leave a comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. Either way, thank you very much. You all take care.